Hey guys. Maddie has to fly out tomorrow morning to do Drop Dead Diva. A couple of weeks ago, Maddie auditioned for a role on Drop Dead Diva. She got the part, and I'm thrilled for her. But we have a competition this weekend. Missing a day of rehearsals is huge. I don't want you to get out on stage this weekend in a competition and look like the Yahoo that doesn't know what they're doing. This TV thing is a special event, but I wish you were gonna be here tomorrow for rehearsal. When Maddie comes back, she's gonna have to play catch up. She better not come back as some Hollywood diva. Maddie and I went to Atlanta, Georgia to film Drop Dead Diva. It was the best experience of her life. Abby thinks I'm jealous because Maddie got the Drop Dead Diva part. And I'm not jealous at all. I'm very happy for Maddie. The thing that gets me mad is they were looking for a 13-year-old, and my daughter just turned 14. She wasn't even given the opportunity to try out for the part. And Abby said that's because she's not blonde. Well, Maddie's not blonde either. So if Maddie can try out and she's nine, and they're looking for a 13-year-old, there's no reason that Brooke shouldn't be able to try out. That right there shows the unfair treatment that goes on in this studio. And I'm tired of it. I'm really excited to be shooting my scenes for Drop Dead Diva. They had me do a lot of takes over and over, and I actually like that because I like to do everything perfect. I can't do it! It was really fun to see Maddie get into her character. I'm really happy for her, but it's too bad that the other girls and moms can't be here as well. Hello! How was it? Great. Tell me about it. I did two scenes, and I did a solo on this fake stage, and then I did a dance scene at a studio. How was your dancing? Did anybody say anything? Were they impressed? After she was all finished, they stood up and clapped for her, and it was... Oh, standing ovation. What did you learn? I need to learn how to use my emotion when I act more. So when you're saying the lines, you need to emote just like you do when you're dancing. Yes. I had a lot of fun on the TV show, but now I have to get ready for competition. You worked on this number while you were doing Drop Dead Diva? You did it? Maddie's kind of like a little machine. When she wasn't rehearsing for Drop Dead Diva, she was in the hallway running her solo and also the group dance. I'm glad you're back. It was definitely fun and a really great experience. But it's good for our kids to know there's life after oh, Abby Miller, Miller and Alex. Exactly. routine is called This Is Me Over You. This music is definitely a subtle note to Maddie. She is the one with the power. Use it, kid. One, push, two, push, three, push, four, push, sweep, sweep. I have a solo and a group member. I also miss the day of rehearsal. I need to work extra hard today. Smile! Change your face. She looked like she forgot a little part. Shoulders, relax. Don't sit down. Don't sit down. I'm rehearsing Maddie's solo, and I can tell she's just not there yet. That one day of missing rehearsal has really set her back. She needs to be ready for competition tomorrow. I'm nervous about my solo, and I missed a whole day of rehearsal. I need to dance well. I don't want to let Miss Abby down. Up next, contemporary, ages 9 and 10, number 591. This is me over you. I just had another dream where everything was as it should be. She was beautiful. She hit everything, and I love this dance. This time we're really through. I'm lying, I'm not trying to fix what was never true. This is me over you. This proves 
that Maddie is truly a professional. She left town, flew on a plane, did a TV show doing a different routine, came back and nailed it. All right, here we go, folks. Junior soloist, our top overall junior soloist. This is me over you, Maddie, from Abby Louise Dance Company. Got an award for you. Hold on, light up with the top 10, giant bow. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Maddie is the winner, hands down. She was amazing. Congratulations, ladies. Thank you. Good job, Maddie. Girl, I watched you step into those turns. I was like, right there, you nailed those, huh? Talk about Drop Dead Diva. You are the diva. Yes, good job. Listen, I blocked out the whole Drop Dead Diva routine because I wanted you to concentrate on this number and on the group number. But now that the group won and your solo is finished, I want to see what they had you do. So can you show it to me? I'm sure everybody else wants to see it, too. Yes? I mean, really, Abby. These girls have just danced their heart out, and the only thing you care about is Maddie running her Drop Dead Diva dance in front of everyone. You're just kind of rubbing this in everybody's face. I'm not running it in everybody's your face. Your name and your reputation, what you want them to set their best foot forward. This is just another example of Abby's blatant disregard for anyone who's not Maddie. So I think that next time that we have the opportunity to do an audition, that everybody should get the opportunity. Where is she going? I don't know where Maddie. she's going. But because of the vultures in this room, that no, poor kid has to go no, like this. Abby. No, Abby. And you know what? Have you know to, who Abby. creates she the does. vultures? It's you. No. Because you try to turn all of these kids against their friend, and that little girl's mortified all the time, but you don't care. How about being a role model? I have heard you say to her, to that little nine-year-old girl, no one would be happy for you. Everyone's jealous of you. Why do you, you say that? Are, look no, at we're you. not. No, we're not. Years you ago. have sabotaged my daughter and the rest of the daughter's kids. Daughter's a little snake. How oh, dare so you call child. my daughter a oh, sneak? Oh, 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 snake. Oh, 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 snake. She's not a sneak. You're a sneak no. and a snake. You do these things to these kids. Too. She is talented. Yes, and she, she is. Nobody's denying it. Because Why in five years, she might not be talented Why anymore. Look at her. Don't say my daughter isn't talented. Anymore. And that's not what I just said. Just said in five no. years she might not be talented anymore. She Look is at her. Very she could be hurt. She may never dance talented. again. I've had it with these moms. They're rude and they're nasty and they're jealous of a little nine-year-old girl who got a part on a television show. Au revoir.